Chinese archaeologists have made breakthroughs in the studying of Tibetan Tubal Kingdom, which lasted about 1100 to 1400 years ago. A large number of cultural artifacts have been excavated from an ancient cemetery in southwest China's Tibet Autonomous Region. Located in North Tibet's Dangsheng County, the site is divided into two major sections, a group of 33 small tombs in the north and six large tombs in the south, among which the largest one is 40 meters on one side. After a five-month excavation, archaeologists found a large number of items made of silver, gold, stones and iron, as well as jades and potteries. Among them, nearly a hundred black and white stones caught the attention of archaeologists. They are believed to be chess pieces used in Go, a traditional Chinese board game appearing in the spring and autumn period and becoming popular in the Tang Dynasty. Archaeologists believe these pieces show that the cultural relationship between the Tang Dynasty and the Tibetan Tubo Kingdom was a strong one. The conclusion is supported by other items featuring Tang patterns and style, such as an earpick made of gold. The shape and patterns of this golden earpick are obviously similar to those of the Tang Dynasty. For example, on its handle, it's a rose finch. This kind of rose finch also appeared on gold and silver wares in Chang'an and Luoyang of the Tang Dynasty. Some pottery fragments with remarkable figures featuring a makeup routine were also discovered. They were called zhe mian, which means ochre faces. This is the first time such figures were found on the Qinghai Tibet Plateau. Last year, local archaeologists found some items dating back to the Tibetan Tubo Kingdom from an ancient cemetery in Nakazu County of Shannan City. A silver plate with ancient Greek elements was excavated. These figures at the bottom of the silver plate are Greek mythological figures, the god of wine, Dionysus and his entourage. Dionysus wears a race of ivy on his head, and his entourage is holding a glass of wine and offering it to him. The whole style is a Mediterranean style, the ancient Greek style. Twenty Sassanian silver coins, which were the official currency of the Sassanian Empire created by the Persians, were also unearthed. Around 180 items from the Tubo Kingdom are on display at the Shannan Museum, including gold and silver wares, potteries, Tibetan stone statues, ancient books and documents, and Buddhist artifacts. Zhang Mengyuan, CGTN.